Hi everyone, welcome. So today doing another friendly 1v1. I have Janja with me today. How's it going, Janja? Hey, how are you doing? Uh, I'm doing fine. So, um, same format as the last two times. Best of seven, five minute rounds, just trying to get through as many maps as we can. The first four I picked, the next four Janja picked. So, where do you want to start? You're the guest. Um, let's start with... Skate or die. Your Ooh, truck. Picking Why one of mine. Truck? Yeah, yeah. Ronan, Ronan kept picking like my tracks. And, like, Why did you even pick your maps then? If you're not <laughs> picking maps you like or want to play. Well, more and more opportunity to play them later. Yeah. <laughs> get get the worst out first. I mean yeah. like I'm I'm looking up to this or down to this one the most, so uh there's one in particular I'm definitely looking forward to the most. It, it's a pretty new track, but I think it's really, really fun. Oh are you talking about the one I think you're talking about? I, I think so, I think so. We'll we'll definitely be getting to it at some point. <laughs> Alrighty. So CTR map here, CTR Bambi. Yeah, I, I didn't even know this was by uh, by Bambi. Yeah, I think this is a pretty old one. It's probably his most popular map. Oh, and I crashed. I think into almost no one first does. run. Yeah, same. I actually <laughs> like. I thought I was on a really good run. I was like, perfect. First time is gonna be strong, and then I can just try and improve. Nope. <laughs> nope. Yeah, the end is make or break on this. It's it's by far the hardest part. Yeah. Like it's it's intended, right? Yeah, yeah, it's entirely intended. It's kind of like a skill shot. Like he could have made it more obvious probably, just as that way. Like beginners, whenever they play this map for the first time, are like, how are you guys shaving fifteen seconds? But I mean Taking it, the it, shortcut. It is like kind of difficult to do with full speed. Oh yeah. The sand there. There we go. All right, 426. That's a solid start. Just getting a time down early is pretty important cuz 5 minutes goes by so fast. I think I've said yeah. it every video, but you don't get as many runs as you think you do. I, I did two runs now and we're down to 3 minutes. Yeah. Um this I, is going way too fast. I think we picked shorter maps in general, so we should get more runs, but um, last week Ronan was picking some longer ones, and it, like I think Frostbite Dash was a minute 20, so I got three runs on it. Oh. <laughs> like, all right. Yeah, I, I, I intentionally picked like uh, shorter tracks. I think um, one of my tracks is 46 seconds, I believe. That's like the longest. Yeah, off the top of my head, the longest I think we have is Feb Test at like a minute five, minute six. I yeah, don't right. remember all the tracks, if I'm being honest. Yeah, at times, uh, they blend up <laughs> in all the tracks. Yeah, oh yeah. Oh. Well, 242s, but not good enough. Apparently my PB is a 42.591. Yeah, mid 42s are pretty good. There's a couple of CTR guys that are like really good at this map that do low 42s. I think my PB would probably be a 0.4, somewhere in that range. Yeah, like if I pull up the GTR, leaderboard, it's Nath, Bambi, and Owl first, and second yeah. and third. Yeah, that makes sense. Those three are all good at this map. Oh, you take an inside wall right there. <laughs> I do. And then I mess up the end. Yeah, I saw. Uh, I was 0.2 green here. I was like 0.16. Um, I think it is very slightly faster to do that, but it really doesn't. Like you, you don't have as much speed because you're landing on a flat instead of the downhill there. True. So. It's, it doesn't save as much as you would think. I think it's very slightly faster. Okay, let's go. Final run. I know. It's going too okay. quick. Final run now. <laughs> Final run if you make it, like, far. I only had one finish. Well. 
right, let's see. There we go. Oh no. Alright, pressure's on, photo mode. And that's even better than my PB. Really? Do you not play this map too much? This is like a, a regular in CTR lobbies. This is uh, older. I mean, you're. I remember playing it in the older lobbies. You're also CTR, but the US CTR lobbies. Oh, well, GG's. GG's. Alright, I, yeah, I, when... I would have been a little concerned if I didn't get that one, if I'm being honest. Yeah, exactly. Um, so, where do you want to go? Loser picks the next map. Okay, let's check the list. Then let's uh, let's continue with my my track. You need the speed bomb. Okay, we'll uh, we'll skip to it because time ran out. One zero. Here it starts. <laughs> I didn't get four zero. That was my goal. I think like a lot of people when they join lobbies, they see me, Warcans, Maki, like new players yesterday, like didn't know who you were, and we're like, no, yeah, I'm just extremely good at this game. <laughs> Yeah, I just barely played the last couple of months, so uh, it's, it's it's not not so strange that the yeah. newer players don't know. Yeah, that's true. I mean, you podium all three ZSLs, right? Uh, yeah. You got fir was it first, third, second? The, la the yeah. three? If I'm correct, I, I was. And overall, I'm, I'm first somehow. Yeah, I mean, you dominated the first one. It wasn't even close. Yeah, okay. But that was the first one. It, it gave me way too many points. The, I'm pretty sure Akane went back and like retroactively changed it, so that way the point system's the same. Yeah, already. Yeah, it, it was, I, I had double the points of second or so, and that, that was ridiculous. Yeah, I, I don't want to make excuses, I really didn't take the first one too serious. And then, like, the second, I was like, oh, this is actually really fun, like, I should try in these. Yeah, I think I was the only yeah. one with, I don't know, maybe a few that really did a few runs on the first uh, ZSL tracks. Yeah, I mean, you you, you kind of killed it. I, I can't say I would have competed regardless. But yeah, until, uh, or I mean, since you play, it's uh, it's a nice competition. Same with yeah. Mackie. Yeah, we have uh, uh, Omni is tomorrow. Close. Yeah. When this video is released, Omni will we'll already know who have won, but... As of right now, we don't. I have the feeling that it will be a different podium overall than the last couple of ones. You think? Right. Yeah. We'll see who plays in it also. It's a, it's a different kind of tracks. Yeah, I really like some of them. Some of them I don't necessarily love. <laughs> but Yeah, same. <laughs> it'll be fine. Let's see. Yeah, the drift one, it, it's really a just get a finish in you know, for me. Yeah, yeah. I, it's I, so difficult for me. I don't know how I feel about the drift one, because I'm like, it. I don't want to call it gimmicky, but it's it's kind of, it's not like the normal game. It's kind of strange. Yeah. It's, it's different. For sure. So you think... Uh, me, you, Maki, will there be a tie break for first to two wins, or are we getting someone joining the, the tie? I or think we will get someone joining the tie. Definitely possible. That 35 is crazy on this. Yeah, I, I'm unable to improve. I'm getting yellows everywhere. I don't know how I'm, I did that. I I don't either. I don't think I I think my PB is a 36.0 oh, something like that. This is one of is this your first map or just one of the first maps? I know this isn't a very old one. Uh, no, this is my second track if I'm correct. Okay. Yeah, my second track. Pretty good. I mean, for I, a I second made. Track. I, sorry. Pretty good for a second track. Yeah, I, I mean, I made some different tracks in between, but I never finished or decorated them. Gotcha. But this is like my second official release track. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you just maybe like, like my fourth track overall that yeah. I made. Just threw together some like ideas, things like that. Yeah. Like see how certain pieces play together. Yeah, I was really a fan of. Uh, 
preserving your speed back in the days. And I made this when I was playing for like a month or so. Yeah, back in the day? No longer yeah, a fan of that? Yeah, Oh yeah, I'm still, <laughs> but even then I was already. Yeah. I was like the only one, so maybe that's why this track never catched on or so. I have no idea, but... Yeah, back then nobody wanted to do that. Everyone wanted boosters. Yeah, everyone wanted to go fast and... I don't want to preserve my speed. <laughs> you want to go slow. But you need speed, Bob. Yeah, exactly. So what's the uh, story with putting Bob in all of your titles? Um, to be honest, <laughs> there is no real reason. Just something you started doing and now you're stuck with yeah, it. Yeah, I, I did it with my first two tracks and then I was like, yeah, now I need to stick with it. <laughs> Guess you got to continue. So yeah, everything is Bob now. I and mean, I it's kind of it. it's kind of how you know it's a Gianja track now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Oh no, I messed up. Well, that's GG on this one. That's a really good time. All um, right. I think it was Sniffles. Yeah, Sniffles it, earlier. It was down going a crazy time. Really fast. I think you know what map we're uh, we're playing next. <laughs> is it the one? <laughs> it, it's the one you're thinking of for sure. Oh, nice. Okay, I, I was looking forward to this one. One of the best tracks in the game right now. Yeah, for sure. Pretty like, really, no joke. No joke. It, it's actually a really good track. I think Mal thinks we keep joking when we say that, but yeah. it's, it's actually a good track. So this is for you and Mal are doing a mapping competition, is that right? What is it? Yeah, we're doing uh, the monthly mapping uh, madness, and basically that means uh, either map or uh, map Mao or me uh, places down a layout like uh, start, finish, and checkpoints. Yep. And then uh, we post that layout and we challenge everyone who wants uh, to connect the dots, if you want to call it like that. Just create a track around it. You cannot um, move any of the original parts. Yeah, just start, checkpoints, finish, right? And there's no track yeah. pieces? No, uh, currently not, but we might do it in the future, so... Okay, keep just an eye Just a few out. parts that are... Uh, that are just, yeah, static. Gotcha. Yeah, and if anybody didn't know about this or wants to do it, I'll, uh, I'll link your Discord, because that's where it's being held, right? It's on your Discord? Yep. Yes. Cool. Yeah, a lot of fun. I haven't made a map yet. I might... When, when even are they due for February? Is it next week? Uh, next week. Next week, Saturday. Okay, so... One so... week after Zizel. Gotcha. Yeah, I might make one. I've been wanting to do more in Editor lately, but... Wanting to do more in Editor means I've been trying to make, like, multiple maps, so I haven't gotten to this yet. Oh, yeah, I get that. Now I've that... been uh, more in the Editor lately than uh, on the track. <laughs> yeah. Now that I've joined the, the elite club, I, I no need to stay in multiplayer. Exactly. <laughs> now you can uh, relax. Do you use the glasses? I don't know if you do. I use them. Okay, yeah. I know some people do, but I think most don't. Oh, that is a wide oh. turn. What was I thinking? Yeah, most <laughs> don't. I think uh, Sox is the only one who really used it. Uh, Seabad, Owl, and Bambi started. Well, Seabad always has, but Owl and Bambi recently started using it. Nice. So we're all rolling the nice glasses. No, I still, I still got my my bone. I'm not. I, I think I'm pretty, uh, pretty set on having this. But it's a status symbol, you know. Nah, I don't. <laughs> I don't put a lot of weight on wins. It. Like, it depends on the lobby. Some like some lobbies are really, really difficult to get a win, and it's like actually means something. But I mean, you can join a three-person lobby and get wins if you want. Like, I don't think it really means much. Yeah. Okay. That's true. That's true. And I mean, getting that many wins is probably more about time played than anything else. Yeah, that as well. Like some people. Uh... I never see them in the leaderboard even, but they have like thousand plus wins. Yeah, exactly. 
I just find it a weird way to, like, people use wins as, uh, like, uh, I guess a status a way, symbol, a way to show suppose. off. Yeah. yeah, show off. Right, time for last. Yeah, round. in a way it is, but it, it it does mean that you're experienced. But as you say, uh, yeah. you can also just join a empty lobby with one player. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm definitely not saying you have a thousand wins. That means nothing. You're probably pretty pretty darn good, but uh, if, if I'm correct, I I let's say eighty percent of all my wins are legit. I might have had some AFK uh, people sometimes in the lobby, but... Wow, you're farming? You got your alt account? <laughs> I used to have, no. <laughs> <laughs> the first few hundred, maybe. Alright, let's see if I can get a snipe here. I saw your time go down. Oh, damn. I think a lot of this map really does rely on some booster RNG. There is a good bit of it. This booster oh, I'm dead. hitting now. 131 solid. You can do 132 on that booster. Whenever I oh, get 130, Omni, it's annoying. With the Omni boost, I noticed, like, if you really take the center of them... Oh, oh damn. Hey. I, it's, I, it's I messed faster. up the last turn, too. Yeah, it's, um, it's not a square. They're, I think, octagons. So, going, like, straight across the middle, you get more of it. But, uh, mm -hmm. what do you want for map 4? Um... Let's play Mill Hill Island. Okay. Skip two. It's two one now for you. It is. It is. For those keeping track, I think it was the Ronin one. We were like five maps in or something, and I genuinely had no idea what the score was. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, uh, I think I'm winning. Yeah, but you did in the end, so. Yeah, yeah. I think the format especially kind of uh, like keeps the the score close. Because you pick maps that you're good at, and then the loser gets to pick the map, so you're probably going to pick a map you're good at. Yeah, but apparently that doesn't work with me. <laughs> I mean, both the maps I've won were maps I chose to play. Well, I, or maps I put into the playlist, and then you yeah, for okay, some true, reason true. choosing them. True, true. Ooh, barely missed it. This is kind of a tricky map to get like the good line on. Yep. I think the the wall with the fans is pretty tough to balance how much you like should go high for more speed later on or cut it close. Yeah, you can most of the time you can calculate it with the speed that you have on the bottom of the, the ramp. Yeah, I usually aim for... If you for... have like 149 or 94 yep. or more there, it's it's fine. Yeah, I usually aim for mid 190s. But if you go too high, like you can get 200 at the bottom if you go really high, but you're just sacrificing so much time by doing that. Yeah, exactly. I think like 195, yeah. Something like that's perfect. Yeah, that's usually what I'm... Like that's kind of seems to be the point where it's balanced out. I mean, that speed does carry the rest of the way, so it matters a lot. One ninety nine might have gone too high, but I need to get the time down. <laughs> yeah, that's really the most important thing here. There's probably only one map where I'm concerned with us DNFing. Black Ice. Uh, um, Black Ice. Yeah, we, we did test the track oh. before and we did both get a finish i really do like that map but it is for sure the hardest map i've put on any playlist with war cans around in you yeah it's but it's a fun one yeah and, and i had messaged you beforehand that you were like comfortable you could probably finish it in five minutes because i don't want yeah, yeah. to like choose maps people are going to dnf yeah that would be kind of unfair like, if you know you can finish, but the other, maybe not. Yeah, yeah. And, I mean, it's not necessarily about, like... The, it, it is, like, competitive and put down good times, but it, I'm trying to just kind of hang out and have fun. <coughs> That's 
the most important thing in Zirkus. Yeah. I mean, if we're, if we're being honest, if I was trying all out, I would just sit here for 30 minutes without saying a word, and then no one would watch. <laughs> That's a really good time, that low 44. That's probably... Yeah, I, I believe I used to have the world record on this, which was like a 44, 111 or so. That's quick. I've seen I, 43s. I know that. Oh. I know Lupin's has a 43. Oh. Lupin's is crazy fast. Yeah, people will forget about Lupins. I don't think he plays as much as like most of the top players, but he puts down some crazy times. Oh yeah, I did vote for him for the fastest uh, driver of 2022. The Zip Awards. Oh yeah. Uh, you won that, correct? Yep. Congratulations. Well deserved. <laughs> yeah, but currently I don't deserve it. You've been on a bit of a hiatus lately. You show yeah, up true. for competition. We don't see you in public lobbies too often. Nah, yeah, true. Alright, let's see. Last run. Wow, that, I didn't even notice you put down the 44 one. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's faster than my PV. I think 0 .2, 0 .3 is about my PV. I'm right behind you as well. And on a good run. I'm going way slow now. Yeah, I'm catching you, so I knew you weren't on a good one. I don't think I have you, but I should have a pretty solid time. Get out of my way! <laughs> and I'm at 44, not too bad. Nah, not too bad. You know what, let's just do it. Let's go to Black Ice. Black Ice? Yep. Yeah, then we have the... The toughest ones out. I mean, like I said, I really do like this map. It is hard, and like I wouldn't expect too many like finishers on it in a public lobby, but I would expect me and you to finish it. Oh yeah, I mean, like I I I, I went sideways already, but I'm just gonna go for a run. Yeah, getting any time down, especially the, like getting an early time down and then trying to risk it, push it. These wall rides are so like narrow to get onto. Not yeah. a lot of forgiveness. The corner after the first loop. That's one of the toughest in my opinion. And then taking the ramp. Yep, yep, yep. I generally find a pretty good cycle for that that lines up with like the, the right flipper raising as I'm getting there. So it works out pretty decently for me. Because it, it is loaded uh, locally, so if you're getting to them at the same time, they should be on the same cycle. Oh damn, you're overtaking me. Good, good, good. Let's see if I can go ahead first oh, no. as well. That 47. Yeah. We were talking I saw it earlier. next to me. Yeah, when this when we were playing a little a little bit ago and this came up, we both had low 48s, and I said, "Who's gonna get the 47 later?" Oh man. That's a tough time to be. Yeah. Even on my screen, you overtook me. Uh, host does load in. Oh wait, I guess it wasn't the first run, so never mind. I think host loads in a second or so early, so that could have been part of it. But nope, ice. This is one of the maps yeah. where once I put down a forty-seven, I'll generally just photo mode like. All right, I'm happy with that. If someone beats it, good for them. They deserve it. Yeah, exactly. There's a few maps right. like that where there's second barriers where once I break it, I'm like, all right, I'm happy. Um, oh, I cannot take it anymore. <laughs> this is this is this used to be like a, a skill test. Like, did you finish Black Ice? Yeah. In your skill. <laughs> People got uh, got really good really quickly. Yeah. It used to be this map, and now it's Jungle Jam 2 and Original Dragon. Oh, yeah. Which are just another level. On a good run, am I about to improve it? On a very good run. Kind of messed it up. Darn. 
Might yeah, so like with the corner after the loop. It's it's so tough, man. Little improvement. I think I improved point two. I was up a half second. Oh wow. I think with this also, people don't really realize, like with these wall rides that have a little ice on them, like you can still wall ride the ice, you just have to like turn very carefully. If you have two tires on the ice and two on the tarmac, then you're all right. Yeah, yeah, and don't don't steer too much because then you will spin out. Yeah, I mean, super soft. Are you a, uh, your controller, right? Yeah. Are you a tap steer person or smooth steer? Uh, smooth steer. Okay, I'm the same. Like 90% of the time I do that. Yeah, I'm, yeah. I think the only times I really tap steer are on like less than 100% friction, like ice, grass, things like that. I find myself yeah. tap steering sometimes. Yeah, but there it's, I feel more beneficial. I think part of it is because I know Sivad only tap steers, and so he's like tried to help me on some ice maps, and so I'm like, oh, you should tap steer on ice. I don't know if you actually should, but my brain just decided that that's how that works. <laughs> yeah, it's probably precision steering is like better, but it's so hard to read ice. Yeah, yeah. And what what uh, what way you're going? So tapping is probably the best. Yeah. I mean, I'm not going to argue with anything Seabad says on ice. He's he's the king. Oh, you won. GG's. Alright. So, which one are you looking at now? Um, let's play Mackie's track, would it? Really? I keep, when you're selecting, hovering over the map, I'm like, this is what he should choose. He will guarantee win that map. <laughs> and then you chose this one? And then you chose Wooded. <laughs> <laughs> There's one that I think you're hands down the best player at on that map, and I'm not particularly good. Like, y you would definitely win it. Oh, uh, I'm saving it for last. Okay, alright. If, if you mean it's the one in the playlist. Oh yeah, it's one in the playlist. Oh, okay. <laughs> But there's a big chance that I will fail it as well. Because, of course, I want to go fast. Yeah, you gotta risk it. Yeah. I mean, with, with us, it's like, you, you know you have to risk it. If you play it safe, it almost does nothing. One of us will hit it. Yeah, safe on Feb test, that's acceptable. Feb test, the line is just too clean. Yeah. Yeah, but honestly, Mao, if you're listening, Fab Test, it's it's great. I can't wait for Mar Test. Very <laughs> excited. It, it has a oh, lot yeah. to live up to. <laughs> every month, a better one. <laughs> I'll make sure in the one v ones every time it gets released, pick it. <laughs> So this is pretty new, isn't it? Uh, if I'm correct, yeah. I, I was asking last night in my Discord, like, which track uh, should I put as my fourth? Mm -hmm. And Mackie said, like, oh yeah, this is uh, my new track, Wooded. Yeah. Short track, it's pretty new, people don't really know it. Flows really well. It flows really well. <laughs> And it's not, Maki track sometimes can be like pretty tough. Like I would say this is fine for beginners. Like everybody can yeah. finish this. Oh yeah. I must have had a good start last time cause I can't hit checkpoint one on a green. Checkpoint one? Yeah, I'm just hitting it. Like I must have started pretty good last time. Yeah, it's a tight corner I have to say. I also keep getting yellows there. The easiest line. Oh. And 35 is pretty solid. Checkpoint 2 is hard. Yeah, you gotta land in that like down slope, like perfect, and then try and not scrub your tires. Yep. Because wood, you're, you slide out a little easier on wood, so the going from tarmac to wood to tarmac kind of messes with you. <laughs> yeah. 
Yeah, that, that's also why I like this track, because it's not all tarmac. Tarmac is predictable, wood isn't. It's got a little character. Yeah. I will say, I, I should be pretty solid on wood with all of the jungle jams. Oh yeah. Most likely. I have, I have a little experience. So when you uh, do in Jungle Jam 2 and Original Dragon, I don't think you've done either of those yet. I haven't done either of them yet, no. I, um... Let's see, maybe tomorrow before CSL. Oh, you don't want to practice the maps? Uh, yeah, but you get sick of them. That's true. I mean, I play Dragon, so I, I, with the Dragon, I can come to part 4 or 5 oh. relatively consistent. Yeah, part 4 is definitely the hardest with Dragon. Yeah. And then not, uh, like, messing up at the end. I don't think 6 is too tough, but it's just like when you're 5 minutes into the map that you've been spending 10 hours on, it's like, oh boy. Yeah. Heart starts going <laughs> a little. Yeah, I was watching your uh, run of the dragon, and I yeah. saw the crash in, uh, in well, section 6. I, I don't know what you're talking about, it was very clean, nothing went yeah. wrong. <laughs> it was all intended. Your heart must have been pounding, man. <laughs> I, I was kind of just like, no way, I just crashed again. Because I think that was the fourth or fifth time I made part six. And, oh. uh, yeah, but then I was like, I don't know how strong that booster up there is, but I can reach it. Please be, please be strong. <laughs> yeah, it was a good run nonetheless. Everything up to that was really clean, and then that was, yeah. uh, rough. Alright, last I, I didn't oh, see no, Pancake's run. Uh, Pancake had a few crashes, like four. Alright, what do you want? We have River Rapid, Dusty Dunes... Is that it? Have we played every other one? I think we have. Uh, we have Dusty Dunes and... Yeah, just two left. Another Game 7. I gotta stop scripting Game 7s. <laughs> every video. So which one are you looking at? Uh, it's your choice, right? No, you won the last- er... Oh, right. You won the last map, it's my choice. Oh. So, looks like we're not playing Dusty Dunes. Dusty Dunes... I mean, you're just so good at that map. I think we both know what would happen if we played Dusty Dunes. Yeah, yeah. No, nobody's competing with you on that I, one. I have a feeling, but... I don't know. When, when she, it's, it's all about that jump into the, the, the funny loop yeah, corner thing. I was, I was watching your runs earlier and noticed I was messing something up. So I was kind of wall riding that entire first turn on Dusty Dunes, and that gave me way more speed than like you had at that turn. And I think yeah. that just makes it pretty much impossible to make that turn. That, that speed is uh, too much for the cornea, but you can um, wall ride the second part of the corner like the entirety of it. I usually do like half of that. Yeah, yeah. I and was, I was that walking. will give you a lot of speed, but it's manageable. It's really like the max speed you can have there. Yeah, it seemed like, if I remember, you were hitting it at like 105-ish speed, which I was think I think I was yeah. into like one teens, and that was not manageable. No, that's too much. Like if, if you come out of the corner with 80, 85, that's really maximum that you can do yeah i mean that it's so helpful to be able to watch someone i mean like your streams on twitch to the zsl like being able to watch some of your runs is super helpful so anybody isn't doing that go watch yanja yeah i uh i try to be uh helpful with that if people just have a question about anything they can always uh, ask yeah i think uh most of the community is pretty open like that I mean, we want everybody to enjoy the game. I think pretty much everyone wants it to grow, so... We're not trying to scare people off. Nope. Everyone's welcome. Yeah. Just ask. We'll help. Let's see, I want to get the 51. This, this is another one of the maps where it's like, if I break the second barrier, I'm happy. Or the sub-51, I mean. Yeah, I can really feel I'm at a disadvantage at the uh, some of the tracks you picked you, you really play them 
more and you have a better route. <laughs> I think, I mean, like I said, if you had picked Dusty Dune at some point and we played all four of your maps, this would be a very different story. Yeah, true. But, that being said, I, I really don't want this to be super sweaty. I think just hanging out playing Zape just is more important. Me yeah, and you will compete tomorrow in ZSL and we'll see how it goes. <laughs> yeah, that, that's the one that counts. Yeah. I'm sure everyone already knows who won. Probably Maki. <laughs> yeah, probably. Though he did say he has some uh, issues with the Omniboost tracks. Yeah, some of them are tricky. Yeah. And some of them the path, like you can hit checkpoints at different uh, orders. Yours, in particular. Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> I think my PB is 10 seconds off the author time on that, so I really need to figure that out before tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, I. What, what was the author time again? I want to One... say 114? Does that sound right? Yeah, that sounds right, I guess. I, I really think... I never even went below that. Yeah, I mean, you you and Maki like setting strong author times. Oh yeah. You got a standard like to live a, up to. An added uh, thing to the track. Yeah. It's not just a track. It definitely does add, like, if people want to, like, when a strong player puts a good author time down, like, it, it's kind of a good benchmark to go for, but. It just takes more time to, like, go for a strong author time. Oh, yeah. Are you going over or below? The I'm, pipe? I go over it. I think if both are done well, it's about a quarter second faster to go over. Okay, that makes sense. Because I was unable to get more time off this. Yeah. Well, a bit, but... I used to always go under, and my PB with under was still a 51 flat, but then Nath told me that he goes over, and I tried it, and I want to say my PB is a 50.8 or 50.7, somewhere in that range. Oh, wow. Well, I'm... Yeah. I'm not on a run. Are you still out there? Looks like nope. you aren't either. Nope, nope. All right, well, thanks for coming on. Um, this was fun. Again, another Game 7. If anyone doesn't know, like I said, Yanja streams on Twitch. Usually, like CSL, the competitions, you seem to be live more during those. So go check them out. I'll have the link down in the description. And thanks for coming on, Yanja. Yeah, thank you as well for hosting this.